God, I love that intro. Hey, everybody, it's Boohead86, and welcome to my first Let's Play. And, it, and in case you didn't see the big giant title or anything like that, the LP is going to be Tales of Symphonia. Now, I kind of decided, I kind of was thinking either to start with a, a brand new file, no gimmicks or anything like that, or I could just edit the game to how I want it to be, and then just do that. Well, I've kind of decided I'm going to use this. I am going to use my old file that has 51 hours worth of gameplay on it. So, so now let's see. Let's see what I want to use. I have over 3,000 grade to use, so that should be fine. Let's see. Definitely want 30 items. Definitely want increased grade. Times 10 experience, I wish I had that. But oh well. Titles. Well, I want all the titles that I had before. Uh, maybe I do. Because some of those titles are kind of neat. Would be helpful. That'll do it. And definitely want all the monsters. Inherent usage of tech. I think that's really needed. Put max HP on. Figurines in the figurine book. I don't. I have no idea what that is. <laughs> well, inherit the current relationship level. Yeah, what the hell? Wait. 
No. Nah, that won't do that. Ex inherit increase inherit gems in possession. Ooh, that might be helpful. But I want the tech. You know what? I think I could get the titles off screen, so I'll just do that and just get all the X gems that I had before. So, yeah, there we go. Inherit all my X skills. Ah, uh, do we increase tension? Affection. Playtime is the most meaningless, fa meaningless factor, so I'll just leave that alone. Besides, I don't want to really have that much. Combos, no. You know what? I'll leave it... I'll just... I'll just leave it like that. We'll start there. Starting a new game with your grade shop purchases. And in cue a long mo more of a long story. Once upon a time, there existed a giant tree that was the source of mana. A war, however, caused this tree to wither away and a hero's life was sacrificed in order to take its place. Grieving over the loss, the goddess disappeared unto the heavens. The goddess left the angels with this edict. You must wake me, for if I should sleep, the world shall be destroyed. Mm, I like that promise. The angels bore the Chosen One, who headed towards the tower that reached up unto the heavens. And that marked the beginning of the regeneration of the world. Yeah, that wasn't so bad. So now, into the story. Lloyd Irving, wake up. Lloyd! <laughs> ah! How do you manage to sleep standing? Oh, Professor Rain, it, is class over? <sighs> Never mind. Let's have someone else answer the question. Genus, how about you? Yes, Rain. Mythos the hero brought about the end of the ancient war in the holy ground of Carlon. Correct. Afterwards, Mythos the hero formed a pact with the goddess Martel to seal away the Desions whom caused the war. But the Desions came back and are now causing everyone to suffer. We covered that in class last time, remember? When the seal weakens, the Desions reappear, just like they have now. I, uh, yeah, I knew that. I, I just forgot. Today is the day of prophecy. It is a very important day, which the Chosen of Mana will receive an oracle from the goddess Martel. Now chosen one, Colette. Yes, ma'am? Tell us about the journey of world regeneration. It is a journey to seal the Desions. Upon passing the trials of the goddess Martel, the summoned spirits that protect the world awaken, and mana is restored. Correct. I suppose we should expect the Chosen herself to know the answer to that one. Mana depletion is the cause of the current food shortages and droughts. It is said that this occurs because the Desions consume vast amounts of mana in their human ranches. The Chosen's journey has two purposes, to revive mana, as well as defeat the Desions. Now, for the next question. Uh, what was that? That's... Settle down. It would seem that the time for the oracle has come. I will go and check on the chapel. Everyone stay here and study on your own. Understood? Professor! I'll go with you. No, Colette. If it is the oracle, the priests will come here for you. Wait here with everyone else. 
Yes, ma'am. Okay, and with that, all that long story set aside, in, we introduced ourselves to the main character of the story, which is Lloyd Irving. He is kind of dim-witted, but he's really, really strong, and I will use him as my main fighter, because I like using him, and he's practically the only one I use. And over here, this guy here, we introduced... This is Genus. This is Lloyd's best friend, and he uses magic. I like using him, too. He... He can pretty much kick ass with any spe any magic that he has, and he will. I will use him as well. And this over here, this girl here, she is the chosen one. She is Colette Br Brunel, I think it is, and she she will be helpful. Well, in most cases, she'll have she'll gain some nice moves later on, and pretty much any any enemy that is light based is pretty much well you know you get the idea so now what do I gotta do now what do you gotta say Clint that night was so pretty yeah I bet it was now what are you gonna say G during class Rain said that when the oracle comes the crucis crystal and shined in the altar shines so that light must be that must have been emitted by the crucis crystal at the temple wow great observation uh, let's see here. Hmm. Well, that'll be important for later. Lloyd, where are you going? Don't tell me you're sneaking out. Rain will get mad. I'm really curious to find out about what's really what really happens to Clit when she receives the Oracle. They always talk about the Chosen of Regeneration in the Day of the Prophecy, but no one tells us what, what really happens. But my sister said to stay and study by herself. Wow. Great. Fantastic. I don't like to listen. It's research. That's just an excuse. So an excuse is an excuse, right? Don't be so stuffy. You're coming too, right? We're best friends after all. I've already covered that. Colette, wanna, wanna come along too? Huh? Um, okay. Yeah, Colette's kinda deadly too. Just like most blondes in America! <laughs> so where to? Where else? That light. You're directly involved in all this. Aren't you curious? Hmm. Are you curious about it? Of course. Okay then, I'll be curious about it too. See? Dwarven vow number four. Don't depend on others. Walk on your own two legs. Uh, dwarven vows are kind of what Lloyd goes by. This is for father as well you can see is a dwarf okay then let's go to the temple not the dwarven vows again you always use those when you need an excuse you thought the it's research line was it was an excuse don't give me that uh, all right Colette and Gina's joined the party very nice so when the Z button appears at the left edge of the screen press the Z button and trigger a skit the skits are useless just so you know. Yeah, yeah, whatever. So now, before before I almost try and cut this off, you know, you know this? This is useful right now. When did this hole get here? Have you forgotten, Lloyd? This happened when Colette... It was during last year's spring cleaning. I was mopping and, and then accidentally... You're such a klutz, Colette. And Col Colette gets the... Title of Klutz! Uh, now I'll just get into the status thing. Klutz. They start. They start with their own statuses, and they start with their own weapons too. So I'm just going to get rid of this one and put on Klutz. So now that that's all taken care of. I think I'm gonna end this off here. So. Oh, shoot. What's going on? It's awfully quiet. Where did everybody go? Colette! And this is Colette's father! Frank! Father! Frank! What kind of a name is that? Thank goodness you're safe. 
Frank, what happened to everyone in the village? If they're all hiding, the designs invaded the village just a short while ago. Thankfully, no one was hurt. They passed through the village and headed for the temple. Why? Azalea has a non-aggression treaty with the designs. You mean that agreement where, where they don't attack the village as long as we leave the human ranch alone? Yes, Grandmother said it, it's to protect me. Oh, where's Grandmother? Hydra is in the temple preparing for the ritual. Hydra's in the temple? But that's where the designs... The priests are there with her. There's no need to worry. Now, Colette. I know, I promise to fulfill my duty as the Chosen. Yeah. She's blonde! Good luck, Colette. Lloyd, Genus, you two should go on home. I'm worried about letting Colette go by herself. I'll go with her to the temple. Me too. But, alright. Thank you. I'll wait at the house. Come back immediately if anything happens. So now, after that long skit, we get into introduced to the name of the city. This is Isalia. And now, while well, that's taken care of, now I'm going to end this off here, and this will tell you about save circles. You can, you can go in the circle, you can save the game, and there. Done, and done. So now I'm going to end this off here. This is Boohead86 signing off, and I hope you all have a nice day, and I'll be back soon.